I'm Clay. And I'm Eli. We're your producers for today's broadcast. Hope you enjoy. Good morning, Eagles. I'm Zach with your news. <laughs> Attention drivers, you must have a parking pass displayed in your car. Officer Marvin will be issuing tickets next week for those who do not. You can pick up a form outside the office to get a pass. Today is Decades Day, and Connor rounded up some people to find out about their costume. Thanks, Zach. I'm here with a couple students who got dressed up for Decades Day. So what inspired your guys' outfits for today? Uh, my girlfriend told me how to dress up like this. What inspired yours? Um, I just thought it was unique, and I didn't think other people would dress up like this. It's nice. What inspired yours? Pinterest. <laughs> that works. I just saw this outfit um, at Spirit Halloween and thought it was really extra cool. Alright, that's cool. That's all for now. Stay groovy, Eagles. Thanks, Connor. Today in SRT, students will be voting for homecoming court. Seniors will be voting only for the king and queen, while underclassmen will vote for both their class and king and queen. Senior candidates are Anna Carterman, Janae Seacott, Gwendolyn Clark, Eden Ritchie, Mallory Schwer, Michael Bilby, Wyatt Bilby, Jonathan Chimbanda, Titus Hill, and Max Martinez. Tonight, there will be a spike ball tournament at 6. Six teams will face off against each other. Make sure you have come to cheer on your favorite teams. That's all for your news. Now over to Hunter with your sports. Thanks, Zach. The boys' tennis team shut out Pendleton Heights 5-0 on Wednesday night in the Indoor Tennis Center in Pendleton. Junior Owen Best went 6-0 and 6-0 in number two singles to lead the way. The varsity improved at 9-5 overall in 6-0 in Hoosier Heritage Conference action. The JV team won 3-0 to move on to 13-1 on the season. The Eagles host LaPelle at 5 p.m. Thursday for their first home match in a month. Cameron is with team member Owen Best to hear more about last night's match. Due to last night's weather inconvenience, with it being very cold and very rainy, the tennis match was played indoors. I caught up with junior Owen Best to find out more. So Owen, how did it feel to play indoors instead of outdoors last night? Um, I mean, it was a lot more different because you didn't have a lot of effect. You had, like, the wind and stuff, so it felt good. All right. That's pretty cool. Well, you guys have been on the road since August 24th, so how's it feel to have a couple more home games before section of this year? It's going to be nice just because we haven't had a lot of moves, so, I mean, playing on the home course is a lot nicer than the Home advantage is always good. How do you feel about the rest of the season and how will it go? I think we'll catch some dubs on the way, especially during sections. That's good. Crank out some W's before section was right. Well, thank you for your time, and uh, back to the sports test with Hunter. Thanks, Cameron. The volleyball team takes on Fort Wayne Carroll tonight at home. Good luck, girls. Tomorrow is the homecoming game. Make sure you come out and show your support for our football team and our school. The boys' soccer game against Greenfield Central was rained out last night. The, boy, the game has been rescheduled for Monday at home. If we win, we will take possession of the traveling 50 Bell. That's all for your sports. Now over to Mason with your weather. Thanks, Hunter. The chilly weather will continue today with a high of 59 and a low of 47. It will be mostly cloudy with some rain showers possible. It will heat up into the high 50s as you walk out of school. Tomorrow, it will start to warm up into the high 70s and low, high 60s and low 70s for our homecoming picnic. It will then drop down to low 60s during the football game. So make sure to bring a jacket. That's all for your weather. Now over to Pam with your birthdays. Thanks, Mason. I'm here with the birthday boy, Ashton Phillips. So, Ashton, you have any big plans for tonight? Yes, I'm going out to eat with my friends and family after football. And, Ashton, how old are you today? 15. 15. All right. And uh, also, happy birthday to Gunnar Hamilton and uh, Caden Doss. <laughs> Cow over to lunch. Thanks, Palmer. Today's lunch is stuffed breadsticks with marinara, cook's choice, doss salad, green beans, fruit cocktail, and mandarin oranges. That's all for your news. Have a great day, Delta.